Congratulations on the victory, Evan. Evan, did you expect that Joe Lozon performance tonight, or did you expect something a little bit different from him? Uh, kind of. I thought he would have pressed a little bit harder on the takedown once he started uh, kind of dictating the pace of the team. Uh, so I was surprised that he wasn't uh, going for takedowns a little bit harder than he was. You said before that you guys are very similar, but you had a clear advantage in the striking tonight. I knew I did, um, but you know, I'm not gonna, I wasn't going to say that before the fight. You know, but his ground is very good. Uh, I respect that his, his ground a lot. Um, and, you know, so obviously I'm going to take the fight where I know I'm better, and I knew I was better on the feet, so that's why I just chose to keep it standing and take it apart. So, it wasn't all that long ago that you were coming off three straight losses. It's not a good place for a fighter to be. Now you're coming off three straight wins. You talked a little bit in the rain about the changes that you made. I'm curious as to, you know, was it just training? I mean, what, what happened that made you sort of turn that corner? Well, if you go back and watch those fights, they're not exactly three straight losses. Just saying. Um, so, you know, I, I, I'm more of a self centered camp now. I worry about myself. I don't, I'm not a part of a big gym. Um, you know, I do my own work. I have a great group of guys that help me out when, when I need them. Um, you know, and I do the same for them. And, uh, we've really got a good core group of guys that work for one another, and that's been a big difference. But you look back at those fights, they're exactly all awesome. You're in a division full of killers, though. I mean, despite having three straight wins against some very legitimate opponents, so it doesn't necessarily put you super high in your ranking simply because of how deep the division is. Where, where would you say that you fit in the division right now? I think I fit in the top 10 because if you watch the fight with me and Dos Anjos, the current champion, I put it on him and go robbed. So, you know, there's only been a few actual fights that I've significantly lost. So, I, think I know, don't think I know I'm right now. Yeah. Yeah. And anyone who, I mean, if you're in the top 10 now, then who's next for you, I guess? I don't know. I wait till they call me and tell me. Would you like to get a top 10 opponent, though? Or it's up to them, man. I just fight when they tell me to fight now. Um, it's got to be a journeyman more than anything. And when they say fight, you know, I fight. Yep. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.